Beloveds, there will become an understanding within your consciousness that everything that is occurring is occurring for you when you have conditions where you believe that there is something that is being done in a relationship dynamic, whether it was with a person or a circumstance, please understand that when you allow yourself to be in harmony with all that is occurring, when you allow yourself to see each event as neutral, when you allow yourself to rest in the faith and the trust and the understanding that you have drawn all events and all circumstances to you to lead you in one direction, and that is back to the truth of you, you can then allow yourself to relax. You can then allow yourself to enjoy what is occurring. You can allow yourself to know with certainty that you have been the creator of these circumstances. Now, this may seem difficult when you have a person in front of you with seemingly very different ideologies. If you can allow yourself to embrace what it is that they think, embrace what it is that they believe, and not think that it is something that is against you, rather that it is something that is for you, something that can bring you closer to light, closer to truth, closer to love, you will not feel the need to do anything but to be in harmonization with them. You can harmonize with anyone. It does not matter if your harmonization is of a higher register or of a low register. You will come to find that each of you has a tone, a note, that is to be sung as part of the great symphony of all of existence. And every one is necessary. You cannot play a piano if there is a key that is missing as fully as if you could play one that is complete. And understand, beloveds, that each of you are a key that is needed and necessary. You will find those with whom you seem to have a greater sense of simpatico. You will have those that you seem to have a greater sense of disturbance. But understand, beloveds, that ultimately you have placed each of these beings within your pathway for your own growth, for your own maturation, for your own experience of love. Allow yourselves then to embrace everyone and everything that comes before you. Know that you have invited them in. Know that you have said, please come and show me the edges of my darkness. Please come and show me where the shadow still lies. Use your breath, beloveds, to move you through any circumstance that arises. When you come upon someone who triggers fear within you, ask yourself, why? So Hannah Grace had a gentleman that approached her in her messaging system, and he was a very handsome man, and her first initial reaction was to fear that there was something that he wanted that she was not ready, willing, or able to give. And we recommended that she breathe. And it turned out to be an enlivening and an enchanting conversation. She allowed herself to embrace the fear. And a miracle occurred. When you allow yourself to live in harmony with what it is that is being placed in front of you, you allow yourself to embrace what it is that scares you, you will find that there is indeed a pot of golden light that awaits you. Allow your truths to surface, beloveds. Allow your lights to shine and engage us so that we may assist you. When you feel challenged with love, indeed, call upon me. When you need help and healing, call upon Raphael. 
if you want to understand the matrices of the mind, you need help in opening your third eye. Indeed, call upon beloved Metatron. If you feel that you need protection, call upon Michael. There are so many of us that are here to help. If you want to understand forgiveness like you have never understood before, Jesus and Mary are there to help. There is so much assistance. There is so much guidance. If you want to understand the pathway that you have chosen, there are many who will come to your assistance. As always, you have your angelic self that expresses itself as love within your existence. Develop this relationship, beloved, and feel the magic that is created. Blessings to you, precious and beloved ones. I love you. We will speak with you again, as we always do.